we started 30 years ago and there were no Domino's Pizza stores here or in New Orleans, Lafayette or anywhere throughout uh, Mississippi, Louisiana. And we started building them one at a time back in the 80s and uh, today we have 135 stores and we have uh, 3,000 people working for us and uh, uh, 500 full-time workers and uh, many part-time and, and just starting out their careers and, and getting some part-time jobs, that type of thing, but we have, we have excellent uh, full-time positions. When Domino's Pizza started, it was a very simple menu, and it was pizza and Coke, and that was it. Uh, today, we've really expanded our menu, and our customers want more variety, and we've, we've met that challenge. Uh, we uh, obviously have you know, great pizzas, but we have four different crusts. We've got five different sauces. We've got um, uh, 22 toppings. We have actually the most variety of any of, any of our competitors. You know, everything from certainly pepperoni sausage to even spinach and feta cheese. So we've got a great uh, combination of, of toppings. And then on top of it, we have oven baked sandwiches. We also have pastas. We also have uh, chicken wings and chicken kickers. It's a great product. And then in the dessert line, we have uh, cinnamon sticks and we've got these great lava cakes. So we've got a very uh, broad menu. And, and again, we, we, everything's designed so that we can hand make everything to customers order and get it to them in 20 to 30 minutes. At Domino's Pizza, we're real excited about helping the football, food, and family program, and it's, it's a natural. We love to give back to the community. We love to uh, help uh, replenish the, the food banks that are in so desperate need, especially with this oil spill, to, to replenish those food banks. And if we can get some friendly competition going from school to school, it's a great thing. And we're teaching our young uh, people and everybody to help give back to the community to help, help those a little bit less fortunate or have really been set back, whether uh, it's a hurricane, an oil spill, whatever it is, we can help replenish these food banks and get people the food that they need. It ties in so well with our history of trying to give back to the community, try to bring people together. Uh, pizza does that in general. It's, it's, a, it's a great time for people to share food. Um, and so it's just a great combination of uh, food, football, and fun. You know, everything, can be marked before and after Katrina, but Katrina really had a devastating impact to, to our company. We had 86 stores closed on, on one day. We had 3,000 people working for us the next day. We had half our workforce that had to meet, attend to their own family situations or maybe moved out of state. We were able to get stores up and running quite uh, quickly. In fact, we're, we were the first ones to open. Uh, we actually opened within 72 hours without any power, without any water, without any utilities. We gave away pizzas first and we went to Ground Zero or wherever, where, where, over in Bay St. Louis, Mississippi, but over, even here in New Orleans, we were, uh, the first thing we did when, in, the, uh, in the French Quarter and even uh, in, over there in Kenner is we, we just donated pizzas to emergency crews and to, uh, to survivors and to, to get them their first hot meal that they probably ever uh, you know, got, and, um, and it was really a rewarding time for us to, to give back to the community at that time. But one thing that we did as we rebuilt our stores is we, we rebuilt them as fast as possible. We had 16 that were completely like flooded or actually off the foundation and completely wiped out. So we were able to get uh, 70 of them back up and running quite, you know, quickly. And again, we were the first to do it. But these other 16 took time. We opened this store in March of 2010 and it's a beautiful store. We made sure we, we made it extra big. It's nothing's hurricane proof, but it's hurricane ready with, you know, generator hookups and things like that, because we're going to be the first to open if unfortunately hurricanes will come again. But this store is a beautiful store and it also is, um, is the 9,000 store for Domino's Pizza. It was actually uh, Domino's Pizza now is, of course, worldwide and over 60 countries and with 5,000 stores in the U.S., but 4,000 are overseas. But in, when you add them all up, this store here in New Orleans uh, was a crowning moment for us because within five years, we were able to say we got back, we, we now cover all of New Orleans, and this particular store is the 9,000th store for Domino's Pizza. So it was really a historic moment and a, and a great accomplishment. You know, every one of our stores is, um, you know, has their own phone number, uh, but we also, uh, they can go to www.donos.com and uh, they, they can order online. And they can also see our, our, me our menu variety and, and, and be able to custom make their order at that time. And they get the adva advantage of the uh, pizza tracker where they can track their order and that type of thing.